Now, ministers at Westminster have unveiled plans for what they say is a green industrial revolution to hit the UK target of net zero carbon emissions by 2050. I'm Oliver Shaw, I'm Head of Centre for Sustainable and Electrical Vehicle Engineering. What's happened most recently was when we identified the need for sustainable and electrical vehicle engineering. And this was identified by industry itself. Industry approached the University of Bolton to try and fulfil its need to train the next generation of engineers. The next generation of engineers are going to require a different type of skill set from what the conventional engineer has had in the past. This skill set will range from working on high voltage electrical equipment and working on fuel cell technology, as well as progressing in the development of battery cell technology. This new set of skills that's required is essential for the industry to move forward and for engineers to supply industry with the development that it requires to move towards carbon neutral targets of 2030. The opportunities this course presents is that you're going to get state-of-the-art training from state-of-the-art equipment provided to us by industry, which are actually developing the technology as we're training people on it. It's also going to give students the chance to go and work in industry, get work experience, but it will hopefully develop into employment. So on my course I feel like I'm part of a wonderful team. Um, there's so much support from lecturers and uh, technicians, your own peers as well. Uh, the university has a fantastic support system and uni as it should be means that you don't ever have to really worry about buying university supplies or anything like that. It means that you can focus entirely on your studies or any extracurricular stuff that you want to do. There's plenty of opportunities, everyone is friendly and approachable. All the staff is nice, they will say hello, you can talk to them. No one's excluded from anything, we all work together. If we need something, if we're struggling, if we can't find something, we're all here to help each other. So some of the most exciting opportunities that are available at the NCME is of course to do with the racing cars but there's a lot of opportunities outside of specifically motor racing, uh, cutting edge engineering, advanced manufacturing, all sorts of sustainability uh, engineering opportunities such as running simulators as you might see behind me, uh, cutting down on petrol and fuel and transport costs for vehicles or manufacturing 3D printing or that kind of thing that cuts down on material costs. It's really cool, I couldn't recommend it more. There's no limitations to what vehicles you can work on if you study this course. It's also developing your knowledge again about the future vehicles, but it's also covering the current market vehicles. You can't understand the fundamentals of a motor car or a van or a lorry without understanding the fundamentals of the ones that we have on the roads at the moment. So you, what we do is we train people from the vehicles that are currently on the market to ones that are coming on the market in both petrol, diesel, electric, hybrid, and fuel cell as well. There's going to be plenty of opportunities and jobs in the future as the electric vehicle market expands and as fuel cells become everyday technology that is used on the roads. The skill shortage that we have in the area will be fulfilled by studying your BN electric vehicle engineering.